Eric here with another radiator grill install with a 2018 Porsche Panamera 4S. So come on with us and let's get to this easy install. We want to show you the before of this install. Take a look at these condensers already dented. This is a stone's throw away from being a dent in your wallet. We're back at the 2018 Porsche Panamera 4S. This is a relatively easy install, relatively quick. And I'm gonna try to show you this in real time and try to keep my head out of the way. This is the driver's side grill. We're gonna notice that with the protrusion towards the right. You're gonna notice with this grill that we have three cable ties installed. These two loops are what we use to grip and maneuver the grill into place. They will be cut off after the install. This is the third cable tie. Now this is our cable tie that secures the grill into place. We want to be sure that this stays in place during the install and check on it periodically to make sure it hasn't moved or started sliding towards the back. Just give it a nice tug, keep it in front. For this install, we're gonna start with the outer edge first. We're gonna insert it into the cavity and we're going to try to get it towards the outside and up as much as possible by reaching our hand in here and rotating and pulling the grill up into that corner until we clear the innermost corner. And then we're gonna slide it up into the cavity. All the while, checking to make sure that that third or that middle securing cable tie is in place. Now we'll take our left or towards the center grill loop and pull that towards center. We'll grab the other maneuvering loop and we're gonna pull the grill down. We're gonna actually pull on that outer one forward until we hear the grill pop into place. At that point, we have it far enough forward to the back of these slats, and now we're going to center the grill, left to right, make sure that the edges are hidden. Now that we've centered the grill left and right, we have it in position. We have our tail ends sticking out of that securing cable tie. We're gonna remove this trim piece. We're not gonna remove it fully, but we're gonna grip it and wiggle it out with some pressure. It'll pop loose and we can kind of push that to the top. We're gonna to reach our hand back in here. We're gonna grab that tail. We're gonna push it underneath We're gonna loosely fit it into that receiving end. We're gonna put the end to one side of, there's these uh, little bump outs here. Just put it in the recessed area of that bump out. And what we're gonna do is just gonna keep pulling and twisting the receiving end towards the back. Pull, twist the receiving end towards the back so we can hide that receiving end and push towards the back until we get nice and generally snug there. Once we have that snug, we can come in and clip off our handles. And we'll just pull those out. And then we'll clip off that tail. Once we're done with that, we'll just simply reinstall the trim piece. That install is complete. That was very quick and very easy. Now these radiators are protected. Before. And after. 
protect it. Before. After. Protect it. 